What's up, everyone? Mark Lobiner, TigerFitness.com. All right, um, people want to see a day in the life of eating. I don't know what my macros are today. My guess is they're going to be around 400 protein, 300 to 400 carbs, around 60 grams of fat. Now, um, it's 5 a.m. I've been up since about 3.45, getting work done over there at my computer. Anyway, pre-cardio, I already took this, but I said to film now. Pre-cardio, have my drop factor. It's my product. And I also have an extra three Yohimbine HCL. Always start at the lowest dose of both of these. And during cardio, I'll be having some Cellucor, just a scoop of this in my Crystal Light Cellucor Core BCAA. Watermelon flavor is absolutely <clears throat> off the chain. Um, after this, I'm going to cook my kids breakfast, get them off to school, get them lunch. I'll show you that process. Um, if you want, if not, you can just turn this video off because I don't understand how people watch these day of eating videos, but they seem to be pretty popular. So I'm going to keep doing it. Anyway, here we go. I'm off to do my cardio. I have 40 minutes of cardio a day now. That's it. Mark Lobiner, that's bro. Time for a day. What's up, everyone? Listen, I love my Myogenics Pro Fiber. Love it to death. But I had to remove it. Too much damn fiber, man. All these sweet potatoes come into my diet. Man, it was getting ugly back there. It's getting real ugly. Anyway, I'm gonna make my famous veggie shake. First off, I'm gonna put in some of this AI Sport Nutrition Cycle Support. This is orange flavor. Um, I have them send me whatever flavor we have stock of, really. So um, if we have more than, you know, I put one in a little bit. Because my body's under a lot of stress right now, man. I mean, my kidneys are processing a lot of water because they just can't hold water right now. There's really no body fat. I'm going to put a little extra core BCA in here. Ah, I mean, this watermelon flavor is so friggin' tasty. And I'll throw my spinach in. Now, I've done this enough times where I can get five, between five and seven grams of spinach first and finish every time. So, pack this in there. I'm going to make a small shake. Um, my main reason for doing this is to get that cycle support in my system. So this is going to be about 5 grams of carbs from spinach. And as you can see, as you can see, spinach, you get a lot of bang for your caloric buck, which is why Pro foods when dieting. Own all. So I'm going to take my during cardio crystal light with core. Now I drink distilled water. Um, mainly I get enough, you know, sodium and stuff for my diet, minerals, and also because they put a lot of fluoride in our local drinking water here in Burlington. And I'm not a hippie or anything, but at the end of the day, I'm drinking three gallons of this a day. And that's a lot of fluoride. I think for the average person drinking what normal people drink, it's not a big deal. For someone like me, it might be. So that's my shake. I'm going to go ahead. Where about my, where about my BBC? Where's my BBC? Got my BBC. Put it in. This isn't a Mad Ogus video. Love you, Ogus. All right, got my shake. I'm gonna actually be civilized and put it in a little glass right here. All right. I'm still gonna chug the rest. Now, again, the Cycle Support will make everything taste bad. They also have a pill form of Cycle Support, guys, called Life Support. But with Cycle Support, if you can chug down the flavor, getting literally double the product for half the price as if you bought it in capsule form. So now I'm going to go over what I have supplement wise. 
Since I'm not having my probiotics, let me see what I've got here. Yep, I'm good to go. Here's what I'm having. All right. I'm going to have Zyrtec. I have allergies. It's spring. Myovite by Myogenics. Multivitamin pack. Slingshot, because I'm having carbs for breakfast, and I like to get that in my system before training. Okay? And some probiotic gummies I got from Costco. They're called um, Digestive Advantage by Ship. You can have one of these. Get a little bit of that in my system. Now I'm going to make some lunch for my daughter. You can watch that too. What the hell? Okay, well, I get up before everybody else. I've been up since about 3 a.m. Just woke up naturally. It is what it is, guys. I don't sleep much. I don't recommend anybody else follow my sleeping pattern. But I've already gotten four hours of work in, already got 40, 40 minutes cardio. Anyway, here's Cammie's sandwich. I'm making her for lunch. I'm going to show you a proper peanut butter jelly technique. These are a double fiber wheat. There's five grams of fiber per slice of this. Um, this is a good piece, good quality bread. Get it at BJ, so it's really cheap too. All right, proof that I'm natural. Boom, Laura Scudder's bitches. Actually, that's Smucker's. Okay, the key to making a proper peanut butter jelly sandwich. Um, Cammy eats a half sandwich for lunch, and I'll show you what else I give her for lunch. Cut the bread in half. Now, you want to peanut butter up both sides of the bread. So it acts as a delivery system for the jelly. All right. Here we go. I can't believe y'all watch this shit. I really don't. Um, <laughs> can't be still asleep. Okay. So you got both sides peanut buttered up, right? All right. There we go. There's a lot of peanut butter right there. She's been making all kinds of essential fatty acids. Take the jelly. Put it on with a spoon. Good amount, a little bit, you know. Don't want it to get all over her at lunch. You can have kids make fun of her. All right. And there's a proper peanut butter jelly sandwich. That looks delicious, doesn't it? All the kids are going to be jocking my girl's sandwich. Now, these cool little cases right here. An ice pack with it. While I'm at that, I'm going to multitask. Katie makes these chocolate chip pancakes. They're organic. And um, they're whole wheat, Trader Joe's. And she makes a whole bunch of them. So that's the kids' breakfast during the week. Here they are. It's a little pancake. Put that in the microwave for when the family wakes up. I'm going to top it. This was sent to me by a guy I helped out with his diet. And he had some questions about training and all that good stuff. And he sent me this wonderful New York maple syrup. This stuff is fantastic. The kids love it. I've yet to try it, but I'm sure it's lovely. Anywho, Thomas will probably have a, a pancake for breakfast too when he wakes up or an egg. Okay, got that. Your sandwich is ready. All that's good. We got the maple syrup out. Now, for the rest of her lunch, she needs either a fruit or a vegetable. Yesterday we had grapes, but today I think we're all with grapes again. All right, go ahead here. Nice little thing of grapes. Last one. Man down. Pluck them out. I'm not even going to edit this shit out. Y'all can figure out how to fast forward on YouTube, right? I'm just going to upload this raw. Raw, baby. Raw. Okay. And grapes are ready. You go ahead. The bags we're going to have. 
in your backpack and your lunch pail. See, this is the glamorous life I live, guys. Yeah, everybody thinks, nah, <laughs> got like a lemon butler and shit. All right, here we go. Got that, we got this reusable Ziploc, because we care about the earth. Somebody asked me the other day on one of my videos, if I'm worried about the carbon footprint I'm leaving on the earth due to my um, eating so much food um, as a bodybuilder, and frankly, I, I could give a shit less. I, I really could. Um, it's just, it's not a big issue for me. I'm not a global warming guy. Um, take it for what it is. And here we go. I'm going to put that in here. Down. We got a uh, little drink for her. And then throw in a little snack. She gets a little treat in her lunch. Just one. Um... go with just a little something to sell over a little Twix and a little Snickers all right and that's her lunch it's good to go Cammy's all ready except there's one more thing I give Cammy in the morning is a very important time she has her pancake which are her carbohydrates and um, you know they're healthy they're good to go however I also make sure she gets adequate protein in her diet. So, my little cup here. She likes vanilla. MTS Nutrition Way. And, uh, Some milk in this bad boy. And all I gotta do is heat up the pancake and she's good to go. Cammy's ready to have breakfast. Next thing you see is what I eat for breakfast. Boom. All right, time for Thomas and me to eat. And Cammy's eating your pancake. How's that pancake, Cammy? Awesome. Okay, Thomas and egg. So I'm using the blender. Blend it up. Spray the pot a little bit. Good to go. That's how I roll. I'm domesticated, ladies. I does it all. Okay, here we go. Thomas' single egg. Alright, cover the pot. Cooks better. Now it's time for my egg pancake. Drop this out. All right. Boom. Put a put four Splenda packets. And no, I don't count Splenda packets. I think I'm lean enough, guys. I think I'm okay. Anyway, here we go. Four Splenda packets. It all evens out. I eat about the same amount every day. Then some ground cinnamon. Well, you know, to just judge it. Blend it up a little bit. Preheat a pan, about medium heat. Okay. Boom. Got that. Pour it in. I use the hell out of this Vitamix, man. All right, there we go. Cover it. That's good to go. And got my pre-cooked sweet potatoes right here. Measure out about 30 grams of carbs from sweet potatoes. Start with 30. I like to eat a little bit lighter before the gym to not have a big stomach bomb going on. Perfect. All right, there it is. Mm, these look tasty. All right, and that's it, guys. I'm gonna cook this up, show you what it looks like. Time to get this off the burner. Mm. 
Keep in mind this is about 50 grams of protein right here. Trace fat. Look at that. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually top this a little bit of Walden Farms chocolate syrup. Then a tablespoon a tablespoon of PB2. Okay. Which we'll mix with that. A couple extra Splenda to make the PB2 pop. There we go. Mix that all together. It's good to go. PB2, Chocolate Walden Farms, a little bit extra Splenda, and sweet potatoes are done. These don't need anything because these are delicious. And of course, Thomas's egg. That's how I does it. All right, I forgot to um, forgot to film this being made, but I actually made a sludge. Two scoops of MTS Nutrition Whey. That's good quality Tupperware right there. With, <laughs> hold on, oh, I only got three blueberries in the lid and I got them on the floor now. Ah, uh, okay. So, there it is, two scoops of MTS Nutrition Whey, 210 grams of blueberries. That's my post-workout meal because I gotta take dog to the groomers and um, what else do I gotta do? I gotta pick Thomas up from school after training, so that's it. Peace. Yo, just had uh, two caramel rice cakes pre-gym. Just felt like getting a little something on my stomach, a little more carbs. Time to drop Thomas off at school and go train. Dude, I forgot to say my pre-workout is, uh, man, this is all fucked up. I'm busy as hell today. I've already worked five hours, <laughs> and I worked uh, 3 a.m. to 8 a.m. Yeah, five hours. Fuck. Yeah, so I'm, I'm busy, I apologize. The weather is beautiful, it's 67 degrees, I got the sunroof open, my Tahoe, it's been paid off for five years. Check it out, man, I had craze pre-workout with uh, Ronnie Coleman's Stacked N.O. I feel like, dude, I'm gonna get some major PRs in the gym today. I'm gonna get some PRs. I am gonna get some PRs, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow it up, dog. I'm gonna blow it up, blow it up, blow it up, blow it up, I'm in the zone. I'm going in. I'm going in, and I'm going to go hard, and I'm going to go hard. Man, I just had them two rice cakes. I could feel the carbs going to my muscle. I literally can. I am so ready for this. So ready to crush it, dog. So friggin' ready to crush it. It's not a game! All right, done training. Um, get my work done. Doing my thing. Anyway, got my meal here. MTS Nutrition Way, blueberries and some caramel. Walden Farms. It's good to go. So I'm gonna eat that, get done with my thing, and uh, Katie will be here to pick me up, but never a wasted moment. Why would I drive home if I gotta just drive back? All right, peace out. All right, here's this meal. Egg whites, sweet potatoes, look how beautiful those look, and some broccoli. All healthy, all good. I'm ready to rock. Um, it's meal three-ish, and it's uh, it's one o'clock, so uh, that's that. I gotta get back to work. Yo, this is how real it is. Got caught on a phone call. There goes my sludge, man. MTS Nutrition Way with blueberries. <laughs> that's it. There's another meal, I, I, and I had some broccoli too. See, there it is with some mustard on it. That's it, man. I got caught up on a phone call. And I got a bunch of stuff going on, so um, so yeah, I kind of forgot to uh, show you the food, but that 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 was that was it. So I had two scoops of MTS Nutrition Whey and some blueberries, and I was good to go. Peace. Okay, this is my meal right here. I'm gonna have some chicken, broccoli, and potatoes, white potatoes, all in one handy thing with some sea salt on it. That's it. All right, here's number one. This is my green shake, spinach, cycle support, BCAA by Cellucor, a little bit of crystal light.
And here's the dinner. Sweet potato, celery, Walden Farms caramel. We got that at TigerFitness.com. Egg pancake, shake. Boom. Last meal of the day, guys. This fills out my macros. Egg pancake. Let's see. It's in the film. Okay. Egg pancake. Boom. I'm going to actually put some chocolate Walden Farms on that. Got sweet potatoes, broccoli, a little bit of that there black coffee. And I filled all my macros. That's 410 grams of protein. 340 grams of carbs, about 65 grams of fat. Filled it in with the peanut butter and all that good stuff. So there's my macros, guys. The most boring video ever. It started out, I was explaining things. I had the tripod set up. I showed you how I make my daughter's peanut butter jelly sandwich even. But my day was crazy today. I had seven conference calls. <laughs> I had, I, I was, it was a nuts day and I probably should have chose a better day to do this. Next week... I will be filming a day in the a week of prep. I'll be training at Power Station and staying at my business partner Chad's house. And um, it's going to be epic. We're going to show everything from cooking meals to me waking up to going to the gym to doing cardio, getting ready for my show in Virginia, uh, my NPC show. And then we're going to do the same thing leading in to my NABA Pro Qualifier. So we're going to put that all into a DVD and include it in orders at TigerFitness.com with MTS Nutrition Products and other products. Guys, I really appreciate you watching this. It's an honor to have you being a part of my life, part of my YouTube channel, part of my family. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. And um, let me walk over here. Preston's asleep. It's a little dark in here. But um, I'm not going to show Katie because she doesn't like to be on camera when she's in her jammies. It's not like she's wearing anything sexy because we're married. We gave up on that. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for being a part of my life. I really appreciate it. I really, really do. And I'm humbled by the fact that you even watch the world's longest, most boring food prep friggin' video ever made. Y'all have yourself a fantastic week, fantastic weekend. And if you have a chance, come out to Indiana this weekend, this Saturday, to see my guest posing. We'll be at the Ram Brewery at 9 p.m. Dinner's on me if you show up. I'm going to buy you some cheap shit like appetizers, but I'll buy you something. Maybe a Diet Coke. This ain't Burger King. You can't have it your way, bitch. All right, guys. Once again, thank you so much. Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com. My guest posing this weekend. It's going to be fun, but remember, it's not a game. Yeah, check it out, yeah, 2013, uh, listen, yeah. I would applaud you, but I don't bear arms. My thoughts are the scare guard across the square off. Slither with snakes, let I do that in. We start like Jack Bowers phone. I don't need a weed charge, yeah. We all collapse and crash and use it as shards of glass to call for another off a piece of my heart. And each boss of motivation within your grass stars burn. So don't reach far, let them hate, don't respawn. Uh, we need to.